So guys, this is Bidum Tashigang. So we just came to pay a visit to my uh, mother's uh, grand like parents right now, and they're also my um, grandparents. We came to visit their house, and we came to visit them as well. So guys, um, don't forget to visit your village sometimes because you know, old is gold. And guys, uh, by the way, uh, something really cool about this is this is the house number, I believe. And uh, if you want to read, it's like this: Ma ni sum do din. That's the house number. It's the house number so like they used everything that was natural they didn't use any plastic back then so that's one solution to beat plastic pollution that's really it so and uh they also have this cat bowl right here that's made of wood it's perfectly square if you can see that that's really cool actually just pour rice cat comes by they eat they also have this thing a dustbin it's not made out of plastic itself it's made out of wood yeah that's a natural thing as well the other thing is that you can see that there's plastic in here, so that's also another solution to be plastic. Close that. Another thing is traditional broom. It's made of bamboo leaves, I suppose. Like, let me see if it works. Not very much, it works. It's time for judgment. I'm just kidding, guys. I just found this really cool thing that's inside this house, you know? It's actually a scale that they used a long time back. So this wood right here is really well seasoned, so it'll never change its moss. And also, you put like the thing that you want to weigh here. Yeah. You hold with this, like for example, we have this sugar bag right here. So we do, we put it on the way, but do not hold from here. You have to hold from this rope right here. So you do it like this, and then now this wood is coming up, right? So listen, if this sugar, if the sugar in the box, like I mean, like a package is at exactly half kg it will stay right here if it's more than half it'll go up if it's less than half it'll go down okay and then this and then these things are really well carved if you see so we are actually wrapping around these like um edges you see that right if it's here it'll be one kg if it's here it'll be half it'll be half kg if it's here, it'll be quarter, and here it'll be quarter, quarter. So, this was the scale that they used a long time back. For example, this sugar right here is 700 grams. So, it's more than half. So, that is why it's um, coming up. So, if I put my finger on it, it'll go, see, higher. So, this is a really, this is like a really cool scale that they use. Long so, guys, uh, we shifted it to 1 kg. As you can see, the rope kind of changed. So, since this is 1 kg, we lift this thing up, and... Is it exactly one kg, guys? No, it's not. So it's like kind of bent down. So that means if we pull this thing right here, it means if it's perfectly straight, it's one kg. But since it's 700 grams, it'll come a little bit lower. If we uh, change the rope, it will always change its reading. So like, this is how the scale works in the olden times. So I'm really surprised. I'm, I'm wondering who even came up with this. It's a really smart way, actually. This is a cool thing that I found is a pogo stick. Woo, woo. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is a really cool looking walking stick. It kind of looks like a hammer. Whoa. I'm Harry Quinn. Just kidding. So if you don't know what kind of a walking stick is this, it's like a defense walking stick as well. So if you have one of these and you're going in the wild, you're like kind of disabled, you know? Like for example, look. So you see this dog right here? I'm not going to scare it, but I will go like this. I'll go towards it. If the dog barks at me, I can, I can do like this. And I can scare it away. So this is another cool walking stick that they use, and um, if it has springs, we can make it a pogo stick. So I, that's why I like this one. <laughs> but I, but I prefer if you guys like can't afford like a real like a walking stick, right? It has like both the legs. Just you, just tell what, just tell them to carve this. It's really easy to use. It can also defend you. I can put it. <clears throat> Now that we have taken a trip across time time lane, you see this? It's um mm. like this might just really basic. It's like a blanket mm. made from pure sheep wool. Daddy, really, it's made of sheep wool only, Daddy, and it's really comfy. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy. 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 Guys, guys, look at this. Check out this really thing, cool thing I found in the inside this kitchen they use in the olden times. This is pretty nice actually. Right now I'm on my summer vacation. 
our exams just finished and uh i was like boy i was gonna we were actually gonna explore other zone cars but right now in tashigang we visited my mother's uh parents and how home homes and it's all, they're also my grandparents we're also here with all the people including my little brother little brother and then, yeah. so guys, uh, this is right now in the kitchen. If you're right now in the kitchen, like the olden times, olden times. And guys, I look at this really awesome thing I found. Can you guess what it is? Yeah, it's a kerosene lamp. I, my parents used to use these in like the late '90s when they were studying, because they all you, you do know Bhutan was underdeveloped at that time a little bit. So what they do is they soak this cloth with oil and then they like. Uh, burn this top right here. I can't demonstrate because um we already have these new electricity light sources and all those things. So uh this this is not needed that much now. But other things I found is this whisk. Wow. Yeah, I think for dal. I think you'd like this. You'd like that. Uh, yeah. it up. There's also a smaller one. I, there's also a smaller one, which you <laughs> use for. You know. There's also this. What? <laughs> What is this? What do you do? Yeah. You don't use it as a woman. Mama, you try. You try, Mama. Also, uh, out of all the things, I found this wood that you can make a slingshot with. It's a Y. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to take this home and make a slingshot. There's also this thing right here. If you do not, you know what's Zao, right? They actually, like, like put it here and they fry it. And this is, like, the, the thing to hold, right? Uh, I think this thing can come off, actually. Look. So, uh, if you want to do it, make sure you uh, you do it like this, like not straight. Otherwise, dong kong kong dong. And under this, you see this. Inside here, they uh, store salt, salt right here. You cover it. So, so this kitchen takes back many years ago, you know. And then, oh my gosh, this is so hard. And then you see, uh, this is the old furnace that they use. If you never saw one, well, you can see it right now. I bet they just like, uh, like puts the, the fire here, and just cooked, cooked and all those things. But also, uh, you guys can see the firewood here, right? That's like that's the wood that they use to make the fire. So like, basically, you just like take some, you shove it in there. But so guys, uh, it turns out long time back, uh, this was actually like the dye. Did you know that? Like. You, I'm not so sure if you can see it, but like, if you break off a small part of it, you can guys probably see some red on it. So they probably use this to dye the silk cloth red. And you can also see this. This is where they used to like dry the grain and all those things. If you don't know, there's like more stuff outside, by the way. So this is how they live long time back. I really like this whistle. It's like a lot. Africa, bro. Let's get the squad down. It's a really small kitchen, to be honest, but like, now you can see this. What do you think this guy, what do you think this is actually, guys? So this right now is actually a bamboo mattress. Like, it's not really like a mattress. It's sort of like some kind of carpet that we like sit on, you know? You know? And uh, like, you see this right here? This is where like all the grains go. And this is the grain grinder. Look here. You just like put the grains here and you just like, I can't, I can't turn it, it's so heavy. But uh, they usually put this thing up here and then they like grind it up. But like, you know, again, we have machines that grind up seeds for themselves as well. Mm. See, my little brother's trying to do it. Cow. And uh, continuing this firewood there. This is probably the wood that they use to make fires, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah. I don't think we need them anymore because of... And guys, another thing that caught my eye is... If we remove this, there's a pounder. And if and if you're thinking that, Turtle, what are you gonna pound with? I'm gonna go here, grab one of these pounders, and start pounding. Who? Who? Ha! Yee! This is probably where like the rice goes. Like probably the pound some how to make. Make thing, ma. You found this thing. <laughs> but again, machine. Let's just put this thing back. It's really heavy, to be honest.
But actually, I think if you get it faster, there will be two people, okay? One with the pound, another one with the pound. So they'll take, like, so they'll take turns. Cut. Hey, Dad. Hey, Dad. Hey, Dad. Can you come over here? Can you, like, demonstrate how the people used to pound? Like, like, turn right, turn that. Come here. Yeah. Daddy. Uh, it's okay. Okay, one, two, three. Go. I lift up. Go. 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 Get up, get up. Where, where's the sleeper? Oh, <laughs> I need Okay, where's another one? So the other one's over there. So. Ah. One, two, three. Go. 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 Up, up. Oh, you have to pull up. Oh, like this. What? My turn. Allah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. That is not supposed to happen. You're supposed uh, to go in more. sync. Here's turn. I thank you. Here's yeah, your turn. turn. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's probably too heavy for you to see. Also, guys, check out uh, what we found again. So this is resin wood right here. It's called Len Song in Shashop. So way before kerosene lamp, actually. So uh, yeah, they usually have this like stand, yeah. right? Stand where they put the wood on and they light it up. But uh, since it burns so easily, it actually does. Uh, it actually doesn't last for that much. So we need uh, like a big chunk of it for it to last like an entire day. If you do not know, this thing can burn way better than the other woods. Just as we are about to show you right now. Okay, wait. I don't think we can use this big chunk to burn it. So yeah. let's keep one here. Let me help you, Ata. Don't like this. Don't like this. See, this is how See? it burns. It burns in one go, bro. So they use this to make song if you do not know because it burns so nicely. Oh it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna get to my hands. So uh yeah that's all gonna be it for this like video in uh uh in the village right now. So guys never forget to visit your village if you don't guys remember remember the saying old is gold. Peace out.